Hello and welcome to another Brick Fan Reaction video! Today we're gonna do the Lego Volkswagen camper van. Don't know how to speak that, say that vaguely though. Also, subscribe. Like and subscribe. Oh, that's cool! That's cool! <laughs> <laughs> designer for the Lego group and I'd like to show you uh, the new model that we've been developing for the past year. It is the second generation T2 Caterman. This project hit very close to home for me because I'm an owner of a T2 uh, van for the last 12 years and I've traveled almost all of Europe now with it. When we were thinking what makes the second generation more special, uh, we thought the sliding door was an important feature. The function actually works very similar to how the real one works. Oh, we whoa. used an old element from the 80s that was originally designed for town fire station doors, just flipped sideways. I wanted to devote special attention to the engine as that's such whoa. an iconic part of this vehicle's whoa. identity. Whoa. It's made so that you can build it all in one piece. Whoa. A popular feature on the second generation campervan was the pop-up roof. It was a three-quarter length uh, roof that could pop up Whoa. while camping and it had a little tent inside that would allow Whoa. for more headroom Whoa. while camping. One of the more challenging features uh, on this model was the steering function uh, since the steering wheel is actually above the wheels. I thought it would be a cool idea to have the front tire also operate the steering as a little throwback to an old Lego team called Model Team. Inside this model you will find a detailed interior with a folding bed, a folding table and a little teapot stove and a fridge that you can open and access Whoa. food inside. One of my favorite elements in this set is the little sand green teapot that you get with the kitchen. Whoa, I just cool. thought that was really cute. We know that these Volkswagens were popular with the surfing culture, so we included a surfboard as an accessory to the model, as well as some camping chairs. For this model, we approached our element designers, Yoel and Nani, to develop two new elements. One was the thinner version of the car tire that we normally use. It allows us to incorporate steering functions more easily and it's also a better fit for some of our classic vehicles. The other element is a windscreen. These models were nicknamed Bay Window for the large windscreen they had and we didn't have any windscreen that would fit this requirement. Our fabrics team also came up with this uh, long tent piece cool. for the pop-top roof and cool. also the drapes inside windows. Oh. Cool. This model was a very iconic it's of cool the counterculture <laughs> movement from the 60s and the 70s yeah. and it's probably wow. hard to find two of the That's same funny. camp vans on the road today. Oh. They were very oh, popular to uh, customize. They were basically a yeah, blank like canvas this. for anyone to personalize their own thing. With this model also, we wanted you to have the option to personalize it and make it unique for yourself. That's why we included a bonus sticker sheet. One of the bigger challenges of building this set was that it's basically a box that opens from all the sides. So you have lids that open in all different directions and all the hinges have to be in different positions. That's a lot of... There's just uh, so much positivity behind the huge community behind the air cooled Volkswagens that are always there to lend a hand on the road and I wanted other people to have a piece of that. Oh, there's another car! Is that another car? I liked how you can take off the engine. It's really cool. And I, and I like how you can actually steer and design your own stickers with it. That's really cool. And I also like the pop-up tent thing. It's really yeah. cool. I like the surfboard, how they included that. How they can include like the chairs. This chair, surfboard, 
Wait. The steering too. Steering, steering was and really cool. Like, I thought it was cool that the doors could open and slide. Yeah, most Lego sets that are cars have tiny. Like they have doors that you can open, but they you don't can't slide. slide. They don't slide. Yeah. And I think that was a really cool camper van. And I think yeah. it would be really great for kids to play with and adults to put on display. It would be really cool. Well, you have anything to say, too? Well, this concludes another episode of The Brick Fam. We, as The Brick Fam, appreciate your viewership. Welcome your comments. And this is Zephra and Javier, Javier signing off.